Good morning cultists, welcome back to another Unbalanced Breakfast with Good Loops. In our last episode, we took the Duchy of Damask from the Abbasids. Um, and in between episodes, as promised, I have uh, split up our retinue who are not Himalayan Mountaineers. I think we'll try to um, divvy them up a little bit more and then have them be dismissed in uh, small chunks. So that we can get them eventually, gradually replaced with the... Himalayan Mountaineers and we're doing this because well we have a bonus for the Himalayan Mountaineers and also um, we'll have we'll end up having more so they'll kind of act as our uh, deterrent against the rebellions and our little own police force kind of thing um, so we can't create the Duchy of Damask yet we are currently trying to assassinate the Abbasid Emperor we'll see how this goes though I don't think there's much chance of it happening anytime soon. So that's kind of a shame, but... We might as well try, right? We might as well try. Okay, I don't have any active missions for my society. Not that it matters, because we can't even lose our cruelty trait. Sure, let's be a close friend of this guy. Why not? Yay, more money! Fantastic. Okay, well, I mean, you're not an actual genius, Vanthus. So, um, get out of my face? Sure, I guess. Good job, doctor. Good job. Get out of my face. Haven't I caught you... ...being adulterous, like, several times now? Okay, um, so... I see, I think China is now stable again. Well, good for you guys. I guess that means we can probably... Aha. Uh -huh. Sultanate of Syria and Emirate of Damask. Well, I want to take the Emirate of Damask uh, for sure. And then to whom do we grant this duchy? I say we go the guy who is actually in Damask. Yeah, this guy. All right, buddy. Merry Christmas. Now, the question is, do we also usurp the Kingdom of Arabia? Um... So, we actually do have a huge chunk of it. Not all of it, but a huge chunk. Hmm, so we could usurp it. The issue with usurping uh, titles is that we inherit the laws that are already there. Um, what I would actually like is for us to create new laws. But I think maybe it might be easier if we usurp it and then destroy it and then reform it. Alright, well let's try it with Syria. Now I know... Or I don't know. It's Agnetic Cognatic Gavel Kind. Ah, crap all over it. Um, okay, well then. Shoot, I was really hoping it wouldn't be that. What about Arabia? I'm assuming Arabia is going to be the same because we're basically inheriting. Um, yeah, yeah, Agnetic Cognatic Gavel Kind. Okay, that's really dumb. But it is what it is. We'll have to eventually give it away to someone temporarily before, uh... What's his face? Um... Sorry, Berwin bites the bucket. Alright, we're gonna go with this guy as our new Viceroy of Andhra. Sure, why not? And I'm also kind of contemplating the possibility of destroying the Empire of Persia. The title, at least. We don't really need it anymore. Um, we only need it for the Looking East and West achievement. Um, the reason why I want to do this is because right now... We get a malice with our... Why do you want the Kingdom of Arabia? Oh, I see, because you own a portion of it. Well, that's completely unacceptable. Um, but the reason why I wanted to get rid of this is because right now we're getting a malice with these dudes. They desire the Persian Empire. Conversely, the people in Tibet... Um, I do not... I did not create the Empire of Tibet. So with these dudes, we don't get the negative malice to um, the Empire of Per or uh, Tibet or whatever. So we are in fact going to destroy this which will piss these guys off a lot but they're due to die soon anyways so you know I'm sure it would be fine. Yeah destroyed liege title but at least there's no more negative 20 um, I mean it's been replaced by something greater but still. Recent events from the in the key empire have caused various rebel factions. Are you serious? You've got to be kidding me. Another Jurchen tribe? You're insane, man. You guys are the absolute worst. 
My god, why are you so bad at, like, keeping things stable? Good grief. Now, that being said, it is kind of time for, um, the Mongol Empire to rear its ugly head, so, uh... Yeah. Sure. Why not? Speaking of artifacts... Let's see, aha, uh -huh. it's a good thing I checked. Yeah, I think we are not equipping our best stuff. The Jian and I think Champion. Okay, so the Champion is level 3, or, uh, as opposed to the Splint Mail Armor, which is level 2. I don't know why we don't just automatically equip the best uh, stuff here. It seems a little odd. Golden Bracelets, obviously better than Silver Bracelets, and we're good. Whoa, Nubia. Welcome back to the world, Nubia. Can we offer you vassalization? We cannot. And we can only do minor holy wars against you right now. Aha! You might actually have some more people who are willing to join our plot against the Abbasid Emperor. We'll see how that goes. Um, probably not that far, actually. Probably not that far. And what's this? My holding in Kumul? Oh, right, more invasion crap things. Well, not invasion, but, you know. Hmm. I wonder what would happen if the Mongols tried to go after the Western Protectorate. What's this? You are trying to... seduce someone? Okay, I mean... I'm not that concerned, but... I guess I'm not super happy about it either. Sure. And this guy wants to arrange a betrothal. Who are you again? Corsica? Absolutely not. Whoa, when did you become independent? Holy crap, I think the Byzantine Empire kind of just exploded from within. And it's currently being led by someone with wolf's blood. Holy cow. Now, we could go to war with her. Um, take Albania. But, ah, uh, right. Albania, also known as Durbent, I think. Sorry, kills up north. Yeah, you know what? We're just gonna hold off on attacking um, the Byzantines for now. Okay, my nephew is dead. I'm sorry, why did he own land? Exactly? Oh, I see. He must have inherited the title from his mother or something. Wait, that was the imbecile. That's funny. Oh, right, so you guys. Um, I'd say let's split one of you guys up and then dismiss that chunk of the retinue. And then once we have replaced you and these dudes are ready to rumble, um, with a full stackness, we will go ahead and uh, replace the other chunk as well. That way we're not losing out on way too many dudes at once, right? I don't know how many I just hired. I may have gone a little overboard. A little crazy. Did I just hire 50 retinue? Um... I sincerely hope I don't go broke, but I really should have, uh, paid more attention. Nope, it seems that we're actually making a decent amount of, uh, amount of money still, and I think as long as we don't go to war and, uh, lose our retinue, um, or our, our other chunks of retinue, I think we should be okay. And people are trying to kill Thonmi. I mean, Thonmi is actually not bad, his stewardship is kind of rubbish. But, otherwise, absolutely not China. Absolutely not. Okay, so this guy likes Muslims and African cultures, and I just saw our name thing. Oh, no. Okay, um, can send this guy as a eunuch. Hmm. I wonder if maybe we can ask other dudes. To join us. Dudes who are... Oh. Okay. What's this one for? Oh, right. That's the, um... Okay, I see, I see. Never mind. That's for the, uh... New, um... New stuff that I have. New filters. Alright, well, sure. Let's send this guy as a eunuch. I don't know what he's doing in my court. And it just so happens that this emperor likes Muslims, so it's perfect. Now, can we get ourselves a female, or sorry, a, um, a Muslim concubine, maybe? A genius Muslim concubine? Um, possibly. Are you... Oh, I see, you're his mother. I don't know if it's 
impossible for us to bribe her and then have her come to our court. Um, but if we can, then I feel like she would make a decent... Yeah, and we can't bribe this kid yet. We might be able to get him killed though. Which means that it'll free up her. And then she can come to our court. And then we can send her off as a uh, concubine. Perhaps. I don't know. Um, I think I just kind of want to focus on the uh, annihilation of the um, opposite emperor. It's taken quite a while to build up any kind of um, uh, opinion here. Or any kind of support, rather. Okay, we're still making a decent amount of money. And Miwino is sick. Uh-oh, that's not good. Well, thankfully, our doctor seems to have uh, treated him properly, so that's good. Right. Right. More places becoming tributaries of China. And my niece is out banging. Good for you. Successor nomination. I beg your fucking pardon? What the hell do you mean, successor nomination? What kind of... What is this? Absolute cognatic elective? What? Why? Why did this... Why did this change? What the hell? Why is it elective and why can't I destroy the title? I should be able to. Okay, well, anyways, we need to give away Tamilicom as well. Let me just do this before I absolutely lose my shit all over this, uh, all over the place here. Okay, so Tamilicom, Syria, Delam, and Arabia. Ah, uh, shoot. I should not have taken these. Uh, I can't destroy them either. Can I change them, though? Because if it can change them, then that would be problem solved, more or less. Okay, so I have a vassal or hire who does not like me. Okay, well, let's bribe these gits. That should be enough to uh, get them to, to like me. So I can change the laws in Arabia. So we're going to go for ultimate geniture, which is great. And as long as I don't have a female heir, we shouldn't um, worry too much about that kind of stuff. Um, and we can do the same in Syria, I'm assuming. Right. So, right now in Syria, we have... We only have two duchies, and this guy's the only holdout. Alright, fair enough then. So, Syria, we should be able to change this to ultimate geniture. Perfect. And Delam... Okay, so we can change Delam back to ultimate geniture. We just need to convince these dudes. Are you serious? You've got to be kidding me. Destroyed leash title. Oh, right. Yeah, okay. They're never going to like me, are they? Well, that's dumb. I don't see Ice Cube dying anytime soon, but we should be careful. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to change that anytime soon, which kind of sucks. That's really, really just a shame. Right, okay. And I guess they've never... Hmm. Good job, buddy. Good job for getting the uh, courtier pregnant and all that stuff. I guess I've never really um, had to hand out vice royalties in this area. Or for a lot of my uh, vice or um, vassals. So they, they're they not big fans of me. Alright, fair enough. Fair enough. Oman. I don't like that Oman currently owns a chunk of this, but I guess it's not that big of a deal. Kingdom of Khumania, Volga, Bulgaria, I... no. Yeah, we can create the Persian Empire again, but I don't think there's any real need. Kingdom of Yemen? This actually might not be a bad idea. So yeah, let's create the Kingdom of Yemen. Fantastic. And I do have a trade post here, so let's not grant all lower titles. And we are gonna go with her. I know she is currently a, um... What's it? I know she is... Uh, ambitious, but we're just gonna conveniently ignore that. Yeah, and I think otherwise... 
Everything else is good. For now, at least, anyways. And these guys are never gonna like me. Not until eight years from now, when they'll finally get over the whole upset by succession law change. Wait, the succession law change doesn't even affect you, though. I changed the succession law in like Syria and Arabia. That doesn't affect you guys at all. What the hell? These guys are stupid. They're really dumb. <laughs> Ah, uh, wow. So funny to see how stupid the uh, vassals can be. Just no sense of self-preservation whatsoever. You know what? Just be on your own. I really don't need you guys being my vassals, alright? I have more than enough to uh, handle right now. I don't need you guys being uh, troublesome too. Oh, I see. Okay, we can ask him to stop backing that plot. You know what? Let's see if we can actually replace all of these vassals who do not like me. So that's a maybe. Okay, well... Sure. We're gonna go with that and hope that he doesn't actually rebel against me and just gives in. Because I'd rather not have to fa fight, um... A faction. Okay, so now we're gonna replace you and you guys are... Get out of here. You, also get out of here. I don't want any of you guys in my kingdom or empire at all. And you are a part of Azerbaijan. Why is he a part of Azerbaijan? That's the question that we need to be asking here. I'm assuming these guys aren't... They don't have territory in my area here, do they? Yeah, I should be checking, but eh, it's fine. Okay, so those gits have been dealt with. You are a part of Transoxiana, so I'm not going to bother you yet. Um, this guy is considering the offer to stop backing a plot, to which he obviously says no. So now we're going to take all of his uh, stuff. So Merry Christmas, you dumb sack of crap. And let's see if we can do the same with the other counties. Whoa, lots of genius ladies out there. Fantastic. Uh, yeah. Let's find... Oh, who? Although Karakum isn't exactly the best county. You know what, though? Karakum is pretty decent, so... That's fine. Oh, right. Ah, we have to search... Ah, right. <laughs> I always do that. I always set myself up for a disappointment that way. Um, why can't... Oh, I see. You're part of Rebellion. Fine. Be that way. We're go gonna give the county of uh, Karakum away to Cha, and you? Come on. There you go. You idiot. You absolute numbskull. Okay, so let's give the other county to this guy. And we are going to create the, or sorry, we're going to take the duchy and then grant it to her. Perfect. So at least she's going to really like me, which is great. And yes. Although she's currently at war with uh, this dude. Let's see if we can actually just ask her to stop. You just peace out. That'd be great. Thanks. Okay, now that you have... Uh, you basically, um, you know, defied my order. So, uh, yeah. Sorry, miss. You're shit out of luck. Okay, we can take the barony first. And then we'll take her uh, actual county. Because if she's reduced down to holding uh, nothing but a barony, she's most likely going to say uh, yes to the whole stop backing plot thing. Which isn't what we want. Okay, so Alamut. Um, they're all pretty much the same in these areas. So I guess we can just have a new dude, or dudette, um, ruling that uh, county and duchy. Um, hmm... Let's go with someone who's relatively younger and also content would be nice. But that might be a bit of a tall order here. Let's just go with this guy. There you go. Okay, now we're going to give you the Duchy of... Nope, not the Kingdom. Not the Kingdom. The Duchy of Tabaristan. Perfect. And you, little kid, you're too young to... Ah. Uh, 
Okay, so we can't take either of those. And I don't think there's any way for me to... Hmm. What about this guy? Yes, another fool has fallen right into my trap. Perfect. Oh, he's gonna say no. Really? Hey, you're not leading any rebellion or factions, are you? He might be a part of a faction, but he's certainly not leading any factions. Okay, well, let's send the retinue that we don't really need up there to deal with you guys. And speaking of retinue, I think we might want to go ahead and hire some more just to fill out those numbers. I don't care what you do with your life, kid. Merry Christmas and all that. Okay, let's just go ahead and pump out some more retinue, please and thank you. Come on, you can do it. I believe in you. There we go. Okay, we're just going to fill this up until the very max. Though I don't know if we've um, completely reinforced the other stacks, but too late. I've already committed to this dumb idea. And I just hope that we are still... Yep, we're still in the green. So that's good. Still a no, eh? Still a no. Oh no. What have I done? I made a terrible mistake. Oops. Shoot. Ha! Uh-oh. This could be bad. This could be real bad. Well, he is currently the, um, leader of the rebellion, so, uh... <laughs> Oopsie. Alright, that's fine though. Uh, let's get you guys over to uh, Voldemort land. And then you can just chillax there. In the meantime, we're going to get our domain troops to mosey on down to Satyapura and all that stuff. And actually, can we get our vassal troops in on this? I guess we could. I don't know how many, how many we'd actually get, but... Let's give it a try, right? Okay, about 8,000 dudes there. And not too many dudes here, I'm assuming. Alright, we're gonna have to use our retinue for the most part, which is fine by me. It's not ideal, because it's gonna cut down on our retinue uh, replacement or reinforcement time and all that stuff, but that's uh, fine. Okay, you know what? Uh, Marshall, let's have you organize the army instead of doing whatever you were doing before. Let's have this lady be our coach or our, our steward, and... Wait, why is it... Oh, right, because Satyapura is currently enemy territories, which is why you can't have that as your rally point. I get it now. Alright, then let's split you guys up, head down south, and then we'll do the same with the other dudes. Yeah, that's good. Well, I guess this is, like, a pretty quick way to deal with the whole vassal... Uh, management issue, so I guess I can't complain too much. It's obviously not ideal, but... Cole has become Bodpa. Fantastic, that's good for us. And they've got about 30,000 dudes. Yeah, you don't... You really don't stand a chance. I don't know why you think that maybe you stand a chance. But you really don't. Let's set Debul to be our rally point um, for there. And otherwise, I think we're going to set... Let's see. It's a good place here. Gilan? Sure, you know what? We'll set Gilan to be our rally point up north. Or closer into Persia and all that. Okay, can you guys not take... Ah, shoot. Okay, they are going to take attrition. Alright, so we're just going to have to move these dudes then. That's fine by me. Alright, you stupid rebellion. I don't know what you're thinking, but... Um, Good luck. You're gonna need it. I guarantee you. Meantime, let's have you guys go down south as well. Sure. I don't really care. And you guys can go in there. That's good. I'm sorry, what was that? Did someone say something about um, us looting, losing uh, fights or whatever? I wasn't actually paying attention. Sorry, I, I don't mean to be like facetious or anything. I'm just... Literally saying, I don't um, wasn't really paying attention to you. Okay, we might be able to catch these guys in uh, Kurdistan if we are fast enough. Right. Okay. That's great. Now, question is... Oh, I see. K 
Okay, well, can we catch them in Zanjan Abhar? We might be able to. Let's just make sure that our commander ranks are filled. That's great. And we're going to lose a fight there, but I don't really care. Yeah, because these guys will come into reinforce and all that stuff. Sure, why not? Oh, geez. Okay, you know what? That stack we don't need to worry about because they are moving into a different uh, territory altogether. So we're good. We are gewd would uh, I don't like what's happening here. Actually, let's have you guys go into Satyapura. Try to take that. You guys can reinforce in Vijnot, and I think that's good for now. And we are absolutely hemorrhaging money. But hopefully this war shouldn't last uh, that long, so I think we're going to be okay. Okay, we are unfortunately not fighting the right stack here, which is just pure unadulterated garbage. Just the worst. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it when it does that. I absolutely just loathe that aspect of uh, combat in this game. Ah, Well, okay, no, we're actually fighting the right army this time. Which is genuinely surprising. But yeah. Okay, so that means that uh, once we are done with this war, we can go ahead and revoke some more titles, and that's great. There's another dangerous faction that's building up. My god, there's just no pleasing these guys, is there? Absolutely no pleasing them at all. You do something, they get pissed off. You don't do something, they get pissed off. Good grief. What a bunch of whiny pricks. Okay, whiny pricks, you hear that? That's 100%. War score, yeah, war score, you dumb fool. Oh no, you've lost Tabriz. Oh. What a shame. Poor baby lost his little county. Aw, oh, schnookums. Did it feel good at least? You dumb bastard. Alright, um, we're not gonna go with the possessed dude, because they can be a little troublesome. Let's go with this guy for the county of Tabriz. And we are, aha, content man. We're gonna go with this guy for the duchy of Tabriz, even though he is not in the better county. And did you rebel against me? You did not. Um, I wonder if maybe we should try to get this guy killed. Yeah, our plot to assassinate the Caliph is just not going anywhere. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get this kid killed and then have him replaced by uh, her, which means that she can start plotting against me and all that stuff so um, we can get this law changed. Finally. Oh, wow, you have a lot of territory there, don't you? Wait, that's not even a part of Baghdad. Wait, what do you have in there exactly? Okay. How do you... Oh, wait, no. Oh, I see. I see, okay. Well, we're going to take the uh, Vice Royalty away from you. Because you're a little prick. Can I retract this guy from you? He's going to say he's a yes. He's not going to be happy about it, but he's going to say yes at the very least. Great. And you are meant to be a part of Basra, which we don't currently have. But whatever. Okay, well, I'm going to give you the Kingdom of Iraq as a Vice Royalty. Which... Doesn't make him super happy, but at least it's... Oh, no. This guy has territory where he really shouldn't. Okay, well, we're gonna take the Vice Royalty of Persia from him. At the very least. How many duchies does he have? Oh, no, those are just counties. Oh, he's got two duchies, I see. Well, that shouldn't be yours, bud. But I can't really do anything about him. So what we're going to do is we're going to humiliate him and hope that he plots something against me. Um, which will give us more reasons to uh, go all apeshit all over his butt. Now who else rebelled against me? Anyone. I remember. You did. You dumb bastard. You dumb bastard. And I don't think we can execute this guy, so what we're going to do is we're going to throw him in the oubliette. He's most likely going to die soon because he's old and he's also incapable. 
And then we'll just grant the Yudachi to his uh, son. Now, it's not ideal right now because we currently own way too much land. And uh, too many duchies and such. Really? You too? Unbelievable. Absolutely the worst. Okay, who else? Who else rebelled against me? You did? Oh, come on. You gotta be kidding me. You know what? Throw her in the Ublia too. Because we can't take the other stuff. Ah, that's stupid. That's really stupid. I could just destroy the duchy title. Oh, actually no, Mudar includes this. Okay, well then you are going to be the new Duke of Mudar. There you go. Uh, what else do we need to give away though? That is Palmyra. Oh, I see, you guys are just in open rebellion and all that stuff. And that's Mosul. Now I can't take more of that. So let's go grant the duchy to one of these content dudes instead. Perfect. Ah, right, Jazeera. Well, I guess I have no choice. But this little kid is going to be the new Duke of Jazeera. Are you kidding me? Destroyed your liege title. You've got to be joking me. What? Oh, right, the Persian Empire. All right. Bunch of malcontents. Just the absolute worst. Okay, um, so what else do I need to deal with? We need to deal with the Kingdom of Delam. Aha! You know what? Wait, can I change it though? I guess it would be better if I change it rather than destroy it. Oh, yeah, this guy's never gonna like me. Okay, fine then. I'm gonna destroy the Kingdom of Delam and then recreate it. There, now it should be... Agnatic Cognatic Ultimate Geniture. Perfect. So, at least now we don't have any issues with um, it going to the wrong hands and all that. Let's give this guy the Vice Royalty because he is content. It's a good look on you. That, however, is not. Oh, you fool. Okay, you know what? Let me actually retract that vassal from you. And he is... Kopior. Okay, he's gonna say yes, great. So, we're just gonna deal with this. Oh no, are you serious? Come on, you little sack of crap. Oh, I see, okay, good. And then we are going to give you the Vice Royalty of Delam. Perfect, you know what? Don't assassinate the kid. We don't need to. We can, but we don't need to. And then we'll just deal with the uh, whole issue of Persia soon enough. Yep, you know what? I think we got this. Um, Mafaza. Yeah, yeah, you know what? We'll, we'll deal with this stuff in the next episode. Uh, I don't want to waste you guys' time doing vassal management stuff. But we're kind of in a bit of a crisis mode right now, so I think we kind of need to switch, uh, switch gears a little bit. So instead of looking outwards to attack people, we might need to look inwards and figure out what the best way is to uh, solidify our control before we... You know, keep expanding and all that stuff, which is only going to compound the problem. Alright, so for now, thanks for watching and have a good breakfast.